Well, hello and welcome again. This is Robert Shine, Managing Director and Partner of Blinky Shine Wealth Management. Thank you for joining us on our Friday Insights Edition. It's a time where we can uh, go a deeper dive on some concepts or some real-time examples of how we're helping clients navigate their total financial picture. So recently, as we all know, the real estate market is super, super hot. And if you're in the market right now and trying to buy something, uh, it, it could be challenging simply because the inventory is low and the demand is super high. And let's say you find that property, whether it be a second beach home or or, or just somewhere, uh, and you finally find that you sell on that property and then it's scooped up because there's 10 or 15 offers on that property in itself. And then, God forbid, you have to compete against everyone because you, you have to worry about, let's say, lending. You have to get pre-approved in an approval letter and then go through the lending experience. And ultimately, let's say if your offer is submitted, it might not be accepted because you might have to go get a loan at the bank versus the offer right next to it would be straight up cash, right? Cash, 30 day close, a contingency removal on appraisals and all this other nonsense that we're seeing in the real estate market. Now, I'm not encouraging you to go chase the market at this time. In fact, I would say, let's take a healthy pause and see you know, what's out there and, and just kind of see how the market plays out over the next couple of months. But that being said, life happens and you see the property, you love it, we can help you facilitate it. So let's go into this concept right now that we've been helping our clients with. Uh, year to date. Here's what's kind of cool is an interesting concept. It's something I've helped about five or six clients year to date with this exact concept. It's called the portfolio loan. And so what, <clears throat> imagine this, let's say you have your trust account. And in this case, you have two and a half million dollars in your trust account. And it's a balanced account. It's got stocks and bonds ultimately, and it's still providing you income on a check a month basis is what we do. And we're still managing it here at Blanky Shine Wealth Management. So we are still on a discretionary basis managing that portfolio for you. Now, you want to be able to compete in this ultra hot um, real estate market, but you don't want to liquidate a million dollars out of your portfolio. Uh, and you don't want to get a loan uh, from the bank just yet to compete because most offers on real estate are gonna accept a 30-day escrow, uh, contingency removal, and cash, right? Cash is king, especially in real estate. Well, imagine if you could borrow against your existing portfolio, nothing changes, so your, your investments stay the same, you don't have to sell anything, so you don't have to realize any capital gains, and you're still invested, so your money's still working for you, and in this case, it's a portfolio value of two and a half million dollars. But let's say you wanna go after a beach condo, and actually we've gone through several of these scenarios for our clients, year to date. Um, I, like I said before, I think I'm on my sixth transaction as it relates to this in guiding our clients through this. And it's very effective in competing in a hot real estate market. Let me give an example why. So you put a side-by-side -side loan at the custodian. So it's a separate account, right? And you open it up and it basically, think of it like 50 cents to the dollar on your margin capacity, how much you could actually uh, take against your, your portfolio. And, and keep in mind, retirement assets don't qualify. So you can't lend against retirement assets, unfortunately. It's just basically trust assets and joint assets. Uh, but it's a bridge loan, it's a portfolio loan. So rates are as low as 1.25%. That's a variable rate that will change when the Federal Reserve changes Fed funds rate. Now keep in mind, Fed funds rate is, one, uh, is 25 basis points right now. The 1% goes to the house, not to Blanky Shine Wealth Management, it goes directly to the custodian. So Fidelity and Schwab, we're not making anything on it. We're just providing this as a service to our clients. But that 1.25% is the lowest that you'll find out there. Now, does this change? Yes, this changes immediately upon when the Federal Reserve changes their interest rate policy. So as an example, the Federal Reserve is saying, listen, maybe 2022, maybe 2023, we're gonna raise the Fed funds rate from 0.25 to maybe, who knows, could be another 25 basis points, at which time this would be one and a half percent effective immediately when the Federal Reserve raises interest rates. So that's long into the future, but as of right now, here's what the rate is. And here's, what, uh, here's what's cool about this. There's no origination fee. Like most loans have origination fees, a fee for this, a fee for that. Uh, this doesn't. With Fidelity and Schwab, uh, they're straight up portfolio loans. Um, and we can open up an account as little as three days for our clients. Uh, and there's no prepayment penalty. So you could pay as you go. As an example, we got a million dollar loan off a $1.5 million investable portfolio. Then you can compete. Immediately, you have your real estate agent, 
uh, you're out there in the marketplace, you have your market, you have, you have immediate cash to close. Let's say you're in the market for $750,000 condo. You got up to a million dollars to spend. Well, you can now have shop with confidence to know you can compete. And if you find the house that you love, you can actually submit an offer. Uh, and if it's accepted, you are now on higher ground as it relates to uh, quick, fast close, and you're more competitive. We're putting our clients in a more competitive position and a more attractive position to actually get what they want when they want it. So you could say, hey, listen, we can put you know an offer on the table, cash, you know, 30 day escrow, uh, and, and then go from there as it relates to that deal. But the best part is, is that the seller is going to listen and the other agent is going to listen because cash is king when it comes to real estate and performance, right? In a shorter window of time is also key. So that puts you right at the top when you're competing to look for what's out there. And what we do is once the account's set up and you get, send us the escrow paperwork, we send that wire right to closing, right to escrow. So it's a straightforward process. Uh, you know, what are the ups and downs, the upside, downside? Well, the downside is when interest rates rise, okay, uh, your portfolio loan will rise with it, okay? But that's not bad because we're at 1.25%. And ultimately, on this example, that is 12500 annually, right? Now, we don't say this is a permanent solution. This is a bridge loan. So ideally, once you secure that property and you're in that property, you know, let's say three, six months, even a year, uh, you can have this this loan on your portfolio as long as you need it. Uh, we recommend shorter the better, but it, it could stay intact and as long as you need it. But once you're in there, then you do the cash out refi. Okay, so you go to your bank, and then you have the time to do the mortgage process on the other side once you're in the home, and then you take out as much as you can, 80, uh, 90 percent, whatever it is, 70 percent, whatever the bank wants and comfortable with, and then you pay down this outst outstanding portfolio loan. And so, yes, you do have about 20% out still remaining. Uh, we could always take it out of the portfolio and sell it off and get rid of the loan uh, free and clear at any point in time. But a lot of clients are taking advantage of the super low 1.25% right now. Again, how does the interest work? Well, it just accumulates. You could pay principal, you could pay interest, you could pay a combination of both or you could just let it accumulate and say, listen, I know this is a bridge feature. I know within 60, 90 days, I'm gonna pay this off. So I'm just gonna let that uh, accumulate. Again, this is an annual rate. So even if you had it out for, let's say three months, uh, you know, that's three, $4,000. That's not much on a million dollars to be able to perform on a house and get what you want right away and put yourself in the first position and being attractive in competing in a real estate that market that's super hot right now, that's pretty good. So like I said before, we're on our sixth transaction year to date. I spent a lot of time on the phone with the clients going deeper on this concept, very specifically just uh, finding out if this is right for you because it's not right for everybody. Uh, but we will have that uh, customized solution for you in that conversation to discover what the best way to go about it is. So, you know, we want to be your first stop shop as it relates to anything financial uh, in terms of answering the questions for you. So I'm very well versed in real estate. Um, I actually just sold an investment property into this uh, real estate market myself and my wife's a real estate agent personally. So we can answer a lot of questions. But yeah, I did sell into the strength of the market just recently. So we'll see how it goes. Um, but right now that's how you compete and that's how we're helping our clients uh, compete in the super hot real estate market. So that's our update for today. That's Friday Insights. Hope you learned something. And if you have a friend or family, feel free to share, like, and subscribe. You guys take care and have a great weekend. And this is the first start of summer, even though it's 120 degrees here in Palm Desert, California. But I hear in the Pacific Northeast or Northwest, you guys are gonna have a hot one this, this weekend too. So everyone stay healthy and safe. Take care, have a good weekend.